Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to enable or re-enable Arrow theme on your Windows 7 computer. So, let's say your computer looks like this, or perhaps it might look a little bit more like Windows 7, even though this is a Windows 7 computer, by the way, and you're experiencing the problem where you don't have the eye candy effects of the Arrow theme. This tutorial should hopefully address that and be able to get that up and running for you guys. So we're going to just jump right into it, and we're going to start by right-clicking on a blank area of our desktop, and you want to proceed to left-click on the Personalize option at the bottom of this context menu. Now to enable the arrow theme, you have a whole bunch of different themes to choose from up here. So if you just wanted the classic Windows 7 look, just select the Windows 7 one, and you have other ones that offer different backgrounds and color schemes that go with them, but this is just a general idea if you wanted to re-enable arrow. You'd want to select one of the themes here. So it's just going to take a moment. It's going to take the most amount of time to go between this Windows 7 basic theme we currently have and the Windows 7 Aero theme. And there we go, guys. We can see the Aero has been re enabled, and you can see the transparency effects. And if you want to enable one arrow theme of a background, you can just click on the theme here. And if you do not want to have a slide show, you just want to have a certain picture, you can click on this desktop background. And if you just wanted one static desktop background that didn't change, just click on whichever one you like the most. And then you would just click on Save Change. And then it would save the background change as well as the color scheme that would be paired with it. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to offer you guys some assistance. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.